Hello, this is Frank Neely from HeartlandDiaryUSA.com, bringing you news every conservative can use. Subscribe to my YouTube channel to stay up to date. Well, CNN is up to its usual tricks. Now, regarding coronavirus, they are falling over themselves backwards to try to use the coronavirus emergency to smear President Trump and to introduce, well, let's say Stalin-esque tactics in the United States where the Constitution will take a second position to uh, emergency powers that could be invoked by the socialist communist state that the Democrats want to see prevail here. You can listen to Juliet Kayyem, so-called national security analyst, promote the idea that the president should take control of basically the entire United States rather than have states, municipalities, and private businesses have any control over their own decisions. Here it is. To every state on their own. So they just are looking at their capacity right now and seeing how much they can build in the absence of federal guidance, right? I mean, in other words, the lack of federal guidance about what these governors and mayors should do and when has been surprising. Um, look, we... Um, do you think they should declare a national emergency? I don't even know what that means for this president. Look, I mean, it's like our 12th. Like, I mean, at this stage, it's been so muted. What we need from the president... Well, no, you know, can I be honest with you? We're going to deal with the, We're going to deal with a crisis with the president we have, not with the one he need, uh, we need, he will not change. Uh, last night was proof of that. Uh, so every governor and mayor is now president. Uh, and so you just, we just have to make those decisions um, and shut it down for a period of time. But the idea that we, three years later, let alone six weeks later, are looking at this White House and this president, like, get over it. It ain't going to happen. And so let's just try to minimize the damage and be grateful that, you know, CEOs, sports leaders, uh, actors and actresses, the prime minister of Canada are doing the right thing, are taking care of us. I appreciate your candor. Sorry, Julia. I'm not normally that political. Don't apologize. It ain't going to happen. Don't apologize. Julia Kayyem and Dr. Roshani Raj, ladies, I appreciate you both very, very much on all of that.